Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So as many of you will know, both Windows 10 and 11 have a little screenshot tool called the Snipping Tool, which enables you to take screenshots on both operating systems. It's a small little tool, and if you just click on New, that'll open up and give you some options. So I'm just going to take a rectangular snip, and that'll save that into the Snipping Tool, where I have some options to edit, and then I can save that to my local machine, as many of you will know. Now, I take a lot of screenshots um, for the purposes of my YouTube channel. And just another how-to video, in case you're unaware, that um, you can take screenshots using the snipping tool. But a quicker way to do that would be to use a shortcut a keyboard combination using the Windows uh, key and Shift and S. So how to do that is, in case you're unaware, you just hold down the Windows, Shift and S key at the same time. And that will open up um, those options for the snipping tool to take different forms of screenshots. So that would be rectangular snip, freeform snip, window snip, and a full screen snip. So just as an example, I'm going to click on full screen. And that will then, what it will do is, if I go to my notifications, that will save that in the uh, snipping tool where, as previously mentioned, you have some options like your ballpoint pen, your highlighter, you can erase, you can use a ruler and so on. And then I can save that uh, locally to my device. And I'm just going to save that and that will actually save that screenshot. And I can work on that later or use it for whatever purpose. Now, um, this applies to both Windows 10 and 11. So I'm using the uh, Windows Shift and S key to open up that snipping tool and those um, options applies to both Windows 10 and 11. It'll work exactly the same on both operating systems. And also, as mentioned, once that screenshot um, has been taken on both Windows 10 and 11, you will find that option in your notifications panel where you can edit and save that image to your hard drive. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.